Los Angeles has so many amazing places to drive. Over in West Hollywood, we're about to start an adventure where the Elantra Hybrid is the star of the show. We'll be in Hollywood, where movies are made and stars are born. And I'll take you through the street, up Sunset, through Beverly Hills, the mountains, and all that to see if the Elantra Hybrid, with its futuristic hybrid technology, is ready for the big time. Here we go. <music> All right, now the fun part, guys. We get to do the test drive. This is what I love. The Elantra Hybrid. Wow, amazing. We're ready to get out on the road and see what it does, but the design is spectacular. Let's get in this, baby, and start driving. Everything is laid out nice and elegantly, very futuristic. All one piece of glass here for your readout. Start her up. Sweet. Okay, you don't hear an engine because it's hybrid. We're on battery power right now. You can see digital readout right here. Okay, so we're based at the fabulous London Hotel. Amazing suites, great views, a rooftop pool overlooking Hollywood, Beverly Hills. Sweet. So let's drive. Our friends at Hyundai created a perfect route from West Hollywood through Beverly Hills, west till we hit the 405, northwest through Sherman Oaks, up to the 101, and west through Calabasas, Agora Hills, south towards the Pacific Coast Highway, and then we'll go east to Joffrey's. This is gonna be cool. So the Elantra Hybrid cruises gently through the hilly streets of West Hollywood. Check my readings, getting a feel for the car, and onto the world famous Sunset Boulevard heading west. The commercial district, big billboards, glossy displays, shops, stores, world famous clubs. Well, it's the LA vibe. We're heading west towards Beverly Hills on the first leg of the test drive. First impressions, uh, more. The hybrid, uh, has a very smooth, smooth delivery. I'm going to go ahead and move it from hybrid to gas. All right. Beverly Hills has plenty of curves, inclines, tight tree-lined roads. The Elantra hybrid moves like a star as we snake through beautiful winding streets, mansions on either side and up ahead. And there's another palace if you're in the market to buy. We're loving the smooth, quiet, comfortable ride through the hills, continuing down Sunset Boulevard along the backside of UCLA. You never get tired of the curves, the tight, tight winding roads in Beverly Hills. And of course, you gotta be careful with those trees right up against the roadside. And now we're heading up to the 405. Here's the 405 getting on the on-ramp. The 405 is definitely one of the best places and most challenging places to drive in Southern California. But the Elantra Hybrid seems perfect for the situation. Crowded freeways, stop and start traffic, the uneven terrain, no problem. The total system output is 139 horsepower and 195 pound-feet of torque, enough to make my drive effortless. Gorgeous mountain ranges in the distance. They're breathtakingly beautiful and they cut your stress level by being in or near them. Their massive size and magnificence provides a sense of wonder and awe, timelessness. Gotta love mountains, it's so beautiful. The terrain here is so gorgeous. Great place to drive cars when the traffic isn't bad. And this morning the traffic isn't bad, which is unusual. This is what COVID-19 does to traffic. It thins it out because people stay home. still north on the 405, wide open in the highway. It's uh, all good. It feels good. It feels comfortable. That CVT really does make a difference when you're moving through traffic, trying to get that additional acceleration. And so you can feel that. And uh, so there's no clue that you're in a hybrid at all. Now we're heading west on Route 101, the longest highway of any kind in California, running through lovely cities like Agora Hills and Calabasas. The Elantra is proving to be impressive on all fronts, ride quality, comfort, and a quiet cabin. You can't see around these corners, so you have to take it at about 15 miles per hour, at least I did. And there, look down, beautiful valley, but snake turns right and left. 
then it just drops down where you can see the valley down there below. As the test driver of this show, I have a healthy respect for driving through mountains and on tight roads. While scenic and beautiful, we have to take every measure of safety. You can see that these curves are extreme. It's gorgeous up here, and the Elantra Hybrid is absolutely flawless. More curves with protective rails on the right, mountains rising to the left. These are the Santa Monica Mountains, one of the most scenic ranges in the country, so you can imagine the joy I'm feeling cruising through this amazing display of nature at its finest. Moving up and down these mountains, the steep canyon rises and curves were not a problem for the Hyundai Elantra. And handling really matters cruising through snake curves like this, hard turns, without really knowing what's around that corner. That multi-link suspension makes the ride comfortable, solid, and enjoyable. And the Elantra Hybrid is showing a body control level that I really love and hardly any roll. And now we're straight out, flat land, so we can open it up a little bit and cruise through this arid environment that is Southern California. Dry, arid stretches of land and highway. It's serene and provides a sense of freedom and solitude, and it also allows us to bond with this vehicle, which is smooth and engaging. Okay, we've worked our way through the mountains, and now it's leveling out, where we see amazing valleys and farmland framed by beautiful mountains. It's smooth as ever, I mean all butter. We're getting closer to our destination, the Pacific Coast Highway. You can smell the ocean and feel the coolness of the sea, and the handling on this baby is as tight as it needs to be. We see the farming setups as we totally enjoy this open road. Abundant farmland, the windows, big, perfect for getting as much as possible out of the views and vistas that make this a postcard perfect route. And here we are at the world famous Pacific Coast Highway. We find a spot to enjoy the fresh air and the ocean mountains. There's a sign right there with the Santa Monica Mountains behind us. This is a good time to look at the interior. The dash, well designed, well organized, futuristic, black on black with red trimming, sports steering wheel, nice. Digital information readouts and content. The side-by-side 10.3-inch -side screens found in the Hybrid Limited models are a unique feature in this class. This includes wireless Android Auto and Apple CarPlay smartphone integration, which is, again, a class-exclusive feature. There's your infotainment readout with tons of options and more content. It's a smart car that connects to your apps and phones and allows you to select your options, whether it's entertainment or information, and of course, the Hyundai information readouts have so much more. There's charger ports right there, drive mode options, all of it right there and well thought out. The Elantra Hybrid strikes a perfect pose against the backdrop of the Pacific Ocean. I'm going to check out the scene, capture some shots of the beautiful coastline, the Pacific Ocean, and nature. Like this guy right here who's sharing a perfect location with me. Mountains high and strong cascade into the ocean in the distance. Beautiful yet treacherous rocks down below. The PCH beckoning me from up above. To me, this is breathtaking, exhilarating and refreshing all at the same time. But it's time to get back on the road and head to my final destination, Joffrey's. So let's get on the PCH, which is one of my all time favorite highways to drive on. And you can see why, right? They call it State Road 1. It's the major thoroughfare, north and south, that runs over 656 miles along California's coastline. The Pacific Coast Highway is gorgeous, but it's also challenging, and it's not to be taken lightly. With mountains on one side, the ocean on the other, and you're only dealing with two lanes, well, you gotta pay attention. Not just go sightseeing, but really pay attention. Obey the 35 mile per hour speed limit, and be sure to practice all the safety measures a good driver should adhere to. If you're so inclined to really want to look at things and take it all in, just pull over on the shoulder or find a nice park area and enjoy it. Meanwhile, the Elantra Hybrid is doing all the things we expect it to do. Perform, provide comfort, and absolute efficiency. Because we've been driving for quite a while and the hybrid is kicking in where we can really save. 
there's an abundance of landmarks, fascinating stops, and places to simply enjoy the intersection of the ocean, nature, dazzling mountains, and the laid-back Southern California vibe. We're coming up on one of my all-time favorite landmarks, Mugu Rock. A distinctive feature on the PCH. It's been in movies and television commercials. It's amazing. Look at that. Formed when the highway was cut through the near vertical ridge of a resistant volcano rock in 1937. Breathtaking, isn't it? Mountains to hike, oceans to swim in. Perfect. Heading south towards Malibu, known for its celebrity homes and of course this beach where surfers gather. And here we are at the historic Holiday House, now known as Jeffrey's, the most iconic restaurant in Malibu. It used to attract stars like Frank Sinatra and Marilyn Monroe. The developer redesigned the space so that every table in the house had a panoramic view of the Pacific Ocean. Ah, nice. We can unequivocally attest to the fact that this Hyundai Elantra hybrid passed every test and every challenge that was thrown at it, including an array of diverse road conditions, elevations, and its ability to handle the stresses of sharp hazardous curves and inclines. Well, that's it for this episode of Autofocus the Test Drive. It's me, Tony Lassane. See you next time.